Hi, I'm Diane Wallace and welcome to Adorama TV. Today we're talking about Lens Baby, and I'm really excited because I haven't had a chance to use them before. So when they said, hey, we're, let's, here's a bunch of Lens Babies, let's do a video on these, I thought, great, this is my opportunity to really check these out and see what all the buzz is about. Um, and I have to tell you, I was not disappointed. I really like them. Lens Baby lenses, let's kind of give you the broad idea, is they give you all great effects on your pictures by giving you a very specific, sharp focus point in your frame and then giving you a really beautiful blur around that spot. So that's like the sweet spot that's nice and tack sharp focus and then great blur. And they give you some different options as well which I'll show you. So you really can get some beautiful effects, interesting effects and really take your portraiture especially up to the next level. Let's start with the spark. This is the Spark, I have it on my 5D Mark III, and this Spark actually does come for a Canon or a Nikon mount, so no worries Nikon users, you can get this too. The Spark is a fixed lens, it's a 5.6 aperture, and it's a 50 millimeter lens. It's manual focus, and the way that you use it is simply put it on your camera, and then when you have your frame selected, you squeeze the lens, or stretch it either way, to put the sweet spot in focus, that one point on your frame that you really like to be in focus and let the rest kind of blur out. But what you can also do is twist and bend this lens, look. And so you get these great effects, you know, different sort of bends and twists to the, to the fabric of your picture that make your images really interesting. I really liked it. Like all of the lens babies, it does have different optics and we'll get to that next. I'm gonna show you what that means. But basically you can change out that center optic piece to get different focal lengths um, and different apertures as well. So lots of flexibility in the Lens Baby system. Let's talk about the optics. Now the Lens Baby system is actually a system of holders and pieces that go inside the holders. So you can change your optics based on what you're trying to shoot. So you can see this is another one. There's one already in the Composer Pro. They're really small and portable. It's a really nice feature if you want to change things. Now you don't have to bring all of your big lenses and a big bag and your whole kit. It's a very portable, easy to change system. The one that I got, the Composer Pro that I got, came with a Sweet 35 and it's in here now. The Sweet 35 optic is a 35 millimeter. It has changeable aperture. You can actually see it. You can see the markings on the side so you can turn it and keep it and it doesn't change on you, which is nice. Again, lots of control. And this glass is really high quality glass. So of all the lens babies, the Sweet 35 and also the Edge 80, which we'll talk about next, really have great quality, superior quality from the others. I do have another optic here. I have the Edge 80 and I wanna change the optics and I wanna show you how that's done because it's really not that difficult. It takes a little practice, but um, there are dots and lines on the lens babies to help you do this but you line up the dots, push in and turn, and voila, it comes right out. And then, here's my Edge 80 lens, and again, it's the same system, it's really simple. Pop it in, and turn, and there it is, it's done. So, very simple changes. The Edge 80 is a little bit different, again, it's really superior glass, it gives you a really nice tack sharp focus point in your frame that you're shooting. One of the big differences, though, is the shape of the sweet spot. Um, on the Sweet 35, it's round. Uh, you'll see those in Instagram filters. We're used to seeing that, I think, not lots of nice bokeh. It's a nice, sweet, round area in the frame. But on the Edge 80, it's straight. So it gives you more of a strip of focus in your frame, and then the rest falls out of focus. So depending on the angle that you've got your Composer Pro tilted in, whether it's up and down vertically or horizontally or diagonal, you can change where that is and it gives you a really different effect. So it's a beautiful complement, these two optics rather, and they both fit in your Composer Pro, so however you want to do it. Actually, all of the Lens Baby optics fit into the holders, so whether you have the Spark or whether you have the Composer Pro, or the other pieces, it's a full system with lots of accessories. So it's a really versatile system, and I love that because you can get such great creative images. It really helps you 
push all of your boundaries and really get amazing things for your clients and for yourself. Thanks for joining us. Have a great time with your lens babies. I hope you go out and play with them and make beautiful pictures. I hope you share them with us. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for lots more great information, educational resources, product overviews, lots of tips and tricks. And don't forget to look at the Learning Center for more information on lens babies. Thanks so much. For all the latest photography, video, and computer gear, visit Adorama.com. Place your order by 8 p.m. and it ships the same day. Plus, next time you're in New York City, be sure to visit our store located on 18th Street between 5th and 6th Avenue.